you know, everyone knows the music industry's dying. You know, who buys CDs anymore? So Phil is uh, gonna take his chances with the internet. We know there's somebody out there. We're gonna find them. We're gonna find them with Kings of Karaoke. Friggy Fresh, you're looking at him right now, baby. Friggy Fresh all the way. We're gonna be finding somebody who has the potential to be a multi-million record seller. I had this dream, and it was sucking on the teat of a she-wolf. Chocolate, I mean, who would hide chocolate in their underpants? Cat had just eaten some of its nib, and it was on the ground. <laughs> It's a well-known fact that everyone has a doppelganger. That's true. I went on tour with doppelganger. It's true. We need a psychiatrist. It just so happens that's my profession. I'm a lawyer. Hi, nice to meet you, Virginia. Come on, Karaoke has a very deep meaning, if you think about it. Uh, what are people doing when they do karaoke? He's probably just a waiter. Well, you know what I think? What do you think? Well, he's probably out to kill me. He's probably out to kill you. So I want you to call him and scare him. Okay. Uh, yes. They're going into a room and they become another person. Well, let me think. Why would someone want to kill Axel Rose? To go down in history forever? Uh, you're not Axel Rose. Do you see what I'm saying? So for all intents and purposes, I am a god. And I figure if you're the god that you purport yourself to be, you will give me guidance. Enough! Get it? The grand art of being somebody else.